Alfred is an elderly patient. You can actually embody by becoming your patients, you can better understand their perspectives and then be a better healthcare provider. How could any health problem be understood better if you could actually experience some of that yourself? How do we communicate the most common visual disabilities and hearing disabilities that a patient might come in with? And how do we frame that inside a patient's story to really teach students about that experience? But in Embodied Labs, you learn about the patient experience. We've had a lot of people come and say, we want this in our classroom in our healthcare training, how can we use it? But then we have a bigger vision for beyond this first experience, how to build a library of human experiences. Instead of a medical student being able to sympathize with their elderly patients, they can now empathize with them. And I think going forward, that's our big goal, to create shared experiences and really open up the possibilities of empathy for healthcare providers. Six of the eight countries in the world where you can be killed for being gay are in Africa. On a continent of 853 million people, we've got fellow Africans north of the border who can be killed for, for being who they are.